Hello, my diamond art friends. Eileen here. I hope everyone is doing well. Um, I got home from work and, well, yesterday I got uh, a piece of mail from Amazon and um, text my friend, because it was friend mail, um, a coworker, and she said, you've got one more thing coming tomorrow. And um, I said, okay. Can I share uh, what you got me on my channel? And she said, uh, sure, go ahead. So um, I got some, I'm gonna show what she sent me. It's friend mail off my Amazon wish list. And uh, Melissa is her name. And this is the card that she sent me. It says, thanks for being the greatest friend to me. We laugh, we bitch, we complain, and I love every minute of it from Melissa and ditto um you make work bearable every day so I, ha I put it all in the bigger bag um just because and I wanted to share it with you guys she got me a book and a couple other little goodies so first she got me some Joffrey's coffee um dragon a roast brew so here it is. It smells great. And it says it's a spellbinding brew of notes of pecan, caramel, and vanilla. And it's a medium roast. It smells really good. So I'm gonna be giving this a try in the next couple days. Um, excited, I love my coffee and I love grinding it up. The next thing she got me it, that I had on my wish list was this DIY crystal sticker um, um, kit. And um, so I wanted to just see what it is. I didn't even open it when it came in. I wanted to see what it was like. It's, if I remember correctly, I think it's supposed to be almost like window cling. But um, comes with a tool kit, which is the pen tray and wax so let's see what's in here so we can see what these designs look like and then we'll take a look at the uh, the drills or the gemstones or whatever that comes with it okay so let's see here hmm I'm not quite sure how it oh I guess it gives you so here is the clear piece and then it gives you kind of like the something you can lay underneath to um, copy the design. Does that make sense? If I could line it up correctly for you guys. Let's see the next one, get it lined up so you can see hopefully as best I can, that one. And I'll show the pages separate so there is like the little film overlay and then the key and here is the last one which I'll just kind of do it over and then do the same thing so clear piece and then what we would copy it does give you instructions on how to complete it And then it comes with the, with the drills or gems or whatever we're gonna call them. Let me get this open and we'll take a look. I might actually do one of these soon just so I can see what it's like. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna stick it on any, like uh, maybe the mirror, the bathroom mirror, or the mirror in my bedroom. It's because I own the mirror in my bedroom, right? All right, so let's take a look. It's like, like a bunch of fun, like colored, like gems almost. So let's see. Oh, there, that's better. Some pink and green, yellow, orange, some blues, pink, some clear, some purples, and then bigger, bigger gems. I'm gonna call them gems. So yeah, that's going to be, I think, a little bit of fun. I'm looking forward to kind of trying to see if, how this goes and if it's as fun as it looks. 
And then the last thing she got me was one of the books on my uh, wish list. She, uh, along with Diamond Painting Cajun, have really inspired me to get back into reading. Um, I read The uh, Coworker by Frida McFadden, The Housemaid, The Housemaid's Secret, and The Teacher. All of those pretty much were like on Melissa's recommendation. Um, and um, right now I'm reading Never Lie by Frida McFadden and um, yeah, it's pretty enjoyable. But I will go over the books that I read um, in the month of April soon, um, maybe in the next couple days. Um, a couple of my coworkers have actually asked to, you know, well, I'm going to send them the books because they mentioned they would like to read them. So I am going to send two of the books that I read to one of my coworkers in Wisconsin and then the other two books that I read, because I only read four, uh, to the other coworker in Wisconsin. Um, also going to send them a bookmark I uh, made uh, from um, using Diamond Art. And I'm gonna send Melissa, never lie, because she hasn't read that yet. And um, also gonna send her a bookmark that I made. Um, kind of just as a little thank you. They're all three of them I've worked with, all the three years I've worked at my current job, and they're pretty amazing. So the, anyway, so the book that she got me is called The Woman in Cabin 10, and that's by Ruth Ware. Um, I've heard a lot of interesting things about this book on TikTok um, and thought it would be interesting to give it a go. Uh, well, I had it on my wish list and was really glad that um, Melissa got me that one because that was actually one of the ones I was thinking of getting during my next book haul that I'm going to do um, coming up. But I did, it does not come like on the back to tell you what the book is about. So what I did is I went online just to kind of find out um, what the book entails and it says, a luxury press launch on a boutique cruise ship, a chance for travel, journalist Low Black Lock to recover from a traumatic break-in that has left her on the verge of collapse, except things don't go as planned. Woken in the night by screams, Low rushes to her window to see a body thrown overboard from the next door cabin. Some of that didn't seem like good English. A luxury press launch on a boutique cruise ship. A chance for travel. Journalist, low black lock. Yeah, it's not good English. To recover from a traumatic break-in that left her on the verge of clubs. All right. Okay, anyway, hopefully um, it's a pretty decent book. I've, Like I said, I've seen a lot of in, um, good reviews on TikTok that I've been watching. Um, Kate, Diamond Painting Cajun and Melissa both have gotten me into doing watching book talks on TikTok. Um, so yeah, I'm really um, looking forward to reading this one. Um, I'm actually going to be reading The Perfect Marriage um, as my next book. Um, one of my other co-workers um, read that recently. Um, she didn't give me an opinion either way, but um, I'm going to read it and see how good it is. Um, but yeah, super excited and Melissa I know I've already told you thank you um, but I want to say it again thank you thank you thank you Melissa I adore my my friend mail very much this book is going to be enjoyed I'm sure definitely you know the way to my heart is through a cup of coffee and the best way to keep a girl calm is to give her some diamond art. That's right. That is how um, I manage life these days. But thank you again, Melissa. I appreciate, appreciate you so much. I am very fortunate to have a friend like you. Um, and it's really amazing that uh, we could meet through working virtually um, remotely from home and have connected in friendship the way that we have. It's amazing. So anyway, that's my video. Just wanted to share my, uh, the gifts that I got in the mail from my friend, Melissa. 
So I hope you all have a nice day or night, whatever it is for you. Take care. Happy diamond painting. And until my next video. Bye.